Hi y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you like to hear someone talk about cats, rats, dogs, or reptiles, go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button down below because it is what I am here for. So I'm pretty excited. Today's video is a pretty big rat haul. I know my rats just turned two. They're still fairly active rats. So we decided to go ahead and give them the greatest upgrade that we could give them at this point. Um, it's a cage I've always, always wanted. It's right here behind me. It's the Critter Double Nation, Critter Nation Double Stack. I don't know exactly what it's called, but it's Critter Nation. It's their double stack model. It's behind me. It's a really big cage. It's huge, huge, huge. It's actually made for... You could probably have three or four rats in there. I've got just the two. Like I said, they're older rats, but my rats really haven't slowed down any, and I feel like they could really utilize the space. So I've already put it together. It's this big old thing back here behind me. I'll do another video once everything's all put together in there and stuff and all set up, but today it's just gonna be the haul of all of these new, great, really fun things that I've got for my rats. So that's what today's video is. Anyways. Um, so the first thing is the cage behind me. Huge cage, mega upgrade. Like I said, once I get everything set up, I'm gonna do like their old cage next to their new cage and everything, and you guys can really see the difference. Their old cage has been plenty big for the two rats. It's They have lived very comfortably in it. They've been totally okay. I just feel like, you know, when you can go bigger, you should go bigger. So that's kind of what we're doing right now. Anyways, the other stuff I've got, um, I've accumulated over some time off of probably mostly Amazon, some from other places, but I'll just go ahead and dive right into that. So the first thing are these bins. I've got two of these, one's in front of me holding everything. Oh, that was loud. This will just be a storage bin that I'll keep all their stuff in. I currently keep it in like a laundry basket next to their cage. And with the size of the Critter Nation, it's going to take up the whole wall space that they utilize currently. So I won't have room for that laundry basket full of stuff. So I just got one of these. And the Critter Nation has a little shelf on the bottom to store things in. So that's what that is. I got them some bedding. The other, um, just some little bedding for foraging stuff. I really like to put foraging bins in there. So the other plastic bin that I got is actually holding all of this stuff that I'm showing you guys. So that's the one that i'll put in the very bottom and i'll fill it with some of this bedding and make it like a really big fun foraging bin for them i got some new fleece for the lining and stuff so i've got this one and this one and i know i just got these at walmart like already pre-cut um it's really inexpensive at walmart to get them in the pre-cut bundles i don't remember exactly how much this one was but this is two yards for four dollars i remember it was printed on the top and I really like these fun pastel -y like colors. So I got those. I have a couple of hammocks, the new hammocks. These I ordered off of Amazon. So this one is just like this, just a basic hammock like that. And then the other one, it's the same kind of pattern, but it's a lot larger. It's got the little pockets for them to go in. They could be on top. They could be inside the pockets. My rats love to get inside little pockets. So I know they're going to love this hammock and they love hammocks. Like I've had hides in their cages and stuff before and they just don't utilize the hides. All they want are hammocks. So I didn't get any hides. I do want to get hides, but I was going to get them this weekend and I didn't have another need to go to PetSmart and right now we're in quarantine so if I don't feel the need to leave my home for just one thing I'm not doing it so in the future I probably will get them some hides but anyways so this I also ordered off of Amazon so it says it's for ferrets I'm gonna well it's got a chinchilla and a rat on the front of the box actually um, I'm going to try and use it with my rats and see if they like it, but basically that's what it is. It's just a little 
wooden bridge thing with the ladder and some fun little enrichments like just climbing and chewing and exploring and enrichment I guess um these binder clips are what I use to hold the fleece down my old ones over time I feel like you just have to replace them because the rats they do go to the bathroom on them and stuff and they can get really nasty I wash them usually, but after two years of washing the same binder clips over and over again, it was just time to chunk them and replace them. These are so inexpensive. So I just chunked them and replaced them. We've got a new cage. We want like new clean setup to start fresh from. Um, my rats love these. They're just little carrot shoes. Uh, let me see something real quick. Just looking at the ingredients, but they're like supposed to be little carrot flavored shoes. I ordered these off of Amazon, so you actually can get them cheaper at Walmart, just so you guys know. Don't order them off of Amazon. Just making sure there wasn't any thing in it. But yeah, so these are pretty good. A lot of times if there's a rabbit on the front, that doesn't mean it's safe for your rats. You want to make sure there's no alpha alpha and things like that in there because the rats don't need that. Of course, some yogis. They love these little yogis. I'm so sorry there's a glare, but they love the yogis. That was an Amazon order. You can find a lot of these stuff in the store, so. And then these, oh my God, my rats go crazy for these. They absolutely love them. Both of these will be gone in like a day. <laughs> As I have two rats, I like to put both of them in there. Um, but they will just eat them up. Like they love them. And then this I got from Walmart. There are just some wooden blocks for them to chew on to help maintain their dental health. These are probably some of my rat's favorite toys. And yes, I got them at Walmart. They do have them on Amazon, but they're like three times the price that they have them for at Walmart. So um, I don't know exactly what these are called. But... I don't know. Fun balls, medium sized. <laughs> but my rats love these. And I love to hide treats and stuff inside of these. So it's really like a really good foraging toy that makes them think and just have to think about what they're doing, I guess. I got another water bottle. I'm still going to use their old water bottle. I love the glass water bottles. They're my favorite. Like I said, I'm still going to use the old water bottle. But just because this cage is so much larger, I want to put one on each level so that they have water access at every level. And then this I ordered off of Amazon. It says it's geared towards guinea pigs. Like it says guinea pig on it. I know you can find these in the stores too because I've seen them in the stores. But they're just little chews. Um, so there's this little hanging thing. And this is what actually says guinea pig on it. Um, and then they've got these little chews that you can... I guess to replace them with because they've got the little holes for dowels to fit into dowels. I probably am not going to use that. I'm just going to toss them all in there. But and then there's these and then one of these little things, which my rats love these things. I call them loofahs. I'm pretty sure they're not loofahs. <laughs> right. But that's just what they look like to me. So that's the whole rat haul. I'm super excited to be able to do all this. Like I said, it's taken me a little bit to like accumulate all of this stuff just because I don't like to spend that much money all at once, but a little bit over time makes a lot more sense. So the next video will hopefully be of this really great grand new enclosure that my two rats, Oreo and Suki, are going to go into and you guys will get to see them in there all having fun and loving their life. So thank you guys for watching. Y'all have a good one.